Please, please. Tiny little bit. Prince Harry has become the first senior member of the royal family to give evidence uh, at court for 130 years after taking to the witness stand in his civil case against Mirror Group newspapers. Uh, he's accused the publisher of using unlawful methods, including phone hacking, to get stories about him, something they deny. Our media editor, Katie Razzle, has been following uh, the case at the High Court in London and sent this report. In a cul-de-sac in central London, the world's media focused on itself and one man. Others have settled claims over the years, but here was Prince Harry, determined to have his day in court. Telling those inside a packed Court 15 and an overflow annex that every single article written about him had caused him distress, and agreeing he had felt hostility to the media even before he knew about their methods. He was asked about this line in his witness statement. How much more blood will stain their typing fingers before someone can put a stop to this madness? Prince Harry told the court he was talking about journalists responsible for causing a lot Prince of... Harry in court, Williams hoax phone call, strip club visit and Chelsea Davy breakup. Duke is being grilled by Mirror Publishers lawyer. Prince Harry has responded interrogations about a hoax voicemail left by his brother William, a trip to a strip club and his acrimonious cessation of relationship with Chelsea Davy in his second day delivering verification and evidence at the High Court. Harry was also questioned if he would be, and I quote, disappointed, should the court not discover in his goodwill and agree and approve to facts concerning his privacy were not acquired by telephone hacking by Mirror Group newspapers, MGN, broadcasters. The Duke of Sussex said he would be, and I quote, speculating, but when nudged more he responded to say he would, and I quote, feel some injustice. To have a decision against me and any of the other people, bringing a claim, given that Mirror Group have admitted hacking, in relation to other cases, yes it would feel like an injustice, if it wasn't accepted. Andrew Green KC, representing MGN, then asked the Duke, and I quote, so you want to have been phone hacked? The Duke of Sussex responded, and I quote, nobody wants to be phone hacked. In 2014, Mirror Group newspaper self-confessed responsibility in four incidents of phone hacking, and since then has established loads of accusations, with celebs involving Hugh Grant and Sienna Miller. The publisher refutes the claims made by Harry. Is the not that the Mirror uh, engaged in phone hacking, or is it more likely than not that they didn't, that they're weighing up just to see where that balance tilts? So it's a slightly different standard, a lower standard, if you like. The Prince also had sharp words for the former Daily Mirror editor, now TV presenter Piers Morgan, saying he makes him physically sick and that he wants to hold him and others accountable for their vile behaviour. Mr Morgan denies wrongdoing. You're right, you're right, you're right. It's been an intense day for Prince Harry, the first time a senior royal... Please join the conversation. Put your comments and suggestions below in the comments section. Thank you for subscribing to this news channel. You will be notified of any breaking news and new post as you become part and parcel of the TAO Media family. Please like and share TAO Media. We love you all. Please support TAO Media Foundation by joining membership and visiting Amazon UK to purchase the displayed books to aid our orphanage projects across Africa.